My name is Amira, known as Amira the Wonderless, and I'm the founder of the Wonderless Women. The Wonderless Women is a hiking and adventure group for Muslim women and women from underrepresented communities. In this short documentary, you will see how the Wonderless Women explore different national parks in the UK in the Wonderless Women Tour 2022. Surrounded by nature for a Muslim is very important. It helps you to align yourself and it also helps you to connect with yourself and connect with God. We head start our Wonderless Women Tour in the North York Road. more than just a hiking group, we're a sisterhood, we are a tribe, we're a community, a community that is there for each other, supports each other and listens to each other, women who give other women the confidence and the encouragement that they need. Okay, so it's the last day of the Wonderless Women Tour and we're here in Exmoor National Park, it's so beautiful. Um, my name is Naima, 
Um, I just want to say that it's been really, really amazing to come today. I haven't been on a wild swim bike before. I had a really good time, made loads of new friends, and it's been really life changing. <laughs> I feel sorry, I just feel a bit emotional, but it's been so nice and um, connecting with other Muslim sisters. And um, it's it's really good for your mental health, and it's it's really good when you're trying to find yourself again. And Alhamdulillah. And here are some really inspiring stories from some of the women that joined us. It was just so great to hear their stories and their journeys and just to see how much this walk meant to them. Hi everyone, so I'm with Naima today. This was her first hike and wild swim with the Wonderless Women and she's been with us on the Wonderless Women tour. What was your highlight of today? I think definitely the swim. The swim? Yeah. And how did the water make you feel? It was freezing cold but it was, it was a really, really nice experience. I've never done anything that outrageous before. And do you think this is going to give you the confidence to go explore more? Yeah, definitely. Definitely getting more. Yay! Thank you. <laughs> so we have Amina here today who's been part of the Wonderless Women Tour. And where are we today? We're in Exmoor. Look at that. How beautiful is that? And have you visited here before? I've never been to Exmoor before. This is my first and why have you, because I know you've, you've, you've been exported to the outdoors, but why have you never visited this part of, part of England? I really had the opportunity to come here and I wouldn't really come here on my own. Um, to be honest, it's, it's such a long way from home. I wouldn't know who to go with, how to get here. Um, I don't really know where I would stay. Um, I don't know much about the National Park. And if it wasn't for the Wondrous Women, I would, I would never have come here. And do you feel like these are the barriers that, you know, women from our community generally face is the not knowing and having the resources there to yeah. visit these parks? Yeah, definitely. Um, the group gives me that community and it gives me exposure to, or, you know, um, it helps me get in contact with other women that are interested in similar things or that might want to come here and, you know, resources that are available, we can car share. Um, some people might live in the South Are you excited for today's hike? I'm really excited. In fact, this is so beautiful. It's stunning. Hi everyone, so we've got Halima here today on our first walk of the Wonderless Women Tour and here's her story. So can you please first tell me where you've travelled from? And how long has it taken for you to get here? And does it seem worth it now? Absolutely. And, and this is your first hike, so tell me a bit about your experience. I didn't expect to see the waterfall, I just thought it was going to be a, I just actually just want the community feeling and meeting other people that are like minded people. explored before what do you think what, what's been your barriers to get out yeah and do you think after this experience you're going to visit more national parks and get out there yeah good oh lovely well is there anything else you want to say to anyone that wants to get outdoors? Just try it. I, I came unprepared, I had the wrong shoes, I didn't have a, a waterproof, but it's, it's worked out, it's worked out, so yeah. Get Perfect. Out. Perfect, thank you very much. So we have Farida here who's been joining us on our walks for over a year now and she has set herself a goal to visit all the national parks 
and she joined us on the Wonderless Women tour this year. How has that been for you? Statistics show that people from ethnic minorities visiting the national parks are very low. But why is this? Why are there people from ethnic minorities not being connected to the national parks? Is it because of the barriers that they face? Is it because of racial abuse? Is it because of the microaggressions? There are so many different things. And one of the main reasons, I believe, is not having a safe space to explore the outdoors. With the Wonderless Women, the work that we are doing is to create an environment where Muslim women feel confident to explore and go hiking and explore the beautiful spaces that we have. <laughs>